What is going on, my fellow gamers? Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Fact of the Game. Last time, I got numbers confused. We just finished 67. It's actually time to begin 68. And what is 68, you might ask? Well, we're going to go back to Assassin's Creed. Might as well get started on that. And what is Assassin's Creed? Well, what's the next one in the series? Three. So, guys, welcome to my playthrough of Assassin's Creed 3. I have not determined what I'm going to do yet, but I'm near point 3. Uh, I've never seen the achievement, so I may be doing 100% again. Who knows? We don't need a passport. This is literally the first time I've woed into this game. We can play the chief or play the achievement. Play the storyline, single player. That's my name. Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up or laughed them off. Sometimes both, but we never took them seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden. Some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years, even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do, and the Templars have the upper hand these days. But something larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. To Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon, though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring, only that this is where they want us to be. When it does, they've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long-lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him, however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. So, okay, so back to Desmond. here. 
Let's go. Oh, gosh. Okay, I can't help out. Guess I'm just walking with everybody. So, we only think I know about three it takes part in 1776. Or the American Revolution. We're gonna make an exciting time. I'm curious how they're gonna make the Templars work. Um, yes. Another moment down went Alice after it, never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. Do you hear us? Uh, yeah. What happened? The temple triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed and entered into a fugue state. So naturally, you dropped me into the Animus instead of, I don't know, making sure I was okay? You weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you. And I didn't want to risk severing the connection. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Right. Of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. It's a key. Just no idea where it is, though. I guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. 
She? Juno, Dad. She's talking to me. Okay, Desmond. While you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. All right. What do you need me to do? We'll start simple. Walk to the marker over there. Okay, it looks like the game got a pretty decent upgrade. Okay, Desmond. Let's practice climbing on these objects. Okay. <laughs> Jillian, it's still pretty easy from the last game. The Square Revolution is still fresh in my head. It's only two games ago. That's a constraint. These are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate. All right, Desmond, follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Templars. Oh, well, what about they already revealed what you're... Free rank's a little bit different, it looks like. I wonder which... Uh, Synchronization level be good now. We should be able to build the world. Time to find out what the temple wants from you. Preoccupied, that's all. Don't forget your invitation. Master Birch will be meeting you inside. Thank you. Where shall I retrieve you once you're done? In front of the Opera House. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring her round at once. Well, thank you. I don't know who you are, but thank you. A deadly performance. Invitation, please. Shall I take your coat, sir? May I take your coat, sir? Email received. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested uh, to kindly find your seats. All right, so what do we have here? We have resume, last checkpoint, restart memory, exit memory, DNA tracker, Amos Training Center. Good evening, sir. This way, please. Oh, my apologies. What am I, a British noble? No, it looks like. Evening, Haytham. Reginald? 
Can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? Once. My father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No, I'm afraid it won't. On to business, then. Do you see him? And the statesman, because he's so great, thinks he's trade as honest as mine. He's seated in one of the boxes above. The stairs are watched. You'll need to find another way up. Double capacity, both against Groach and I already have. For it is but fitting that we should protect and encourage cheats, since we live by them. Sir, Black Maul at set word Shit. of trial comes on in the this afternoon. Violence is and she hopes you will order matters so as to bring her on. A as thousand pounds. So sorry. You may satisfy that I'll soften the evidence. Tom Gag, sir, is found guilty. No lazy thought. When I took him the time before, I told him what would come to if he did not mend his hand. This is death without reprieve. I may get to the balcony. Let's do it. For Tom Gag. Forty pounds. Let Betty Sly know I'll save her from the transportation. So I can get more by her staying in. Betty has brought more goods into our lot mm -hmm. here than any five Don't let me guess. And in truth, it's a pity to lose so good a customer. If none of the gang take her off, she may, in the common course of business, leave her twelve months longer. I love to let women escape. A good sportsman always lets the end of cartridges fly, because the free of the game depends on you. Besides, here the law allows us no reward. There's nothing to be got by the death of women. Except uh, for a while. I don't know if they didn't put it Must do all was obliged to find the chicken. I went back today. Oh god, I have to go off. When a gentleman is long kept in suspense, penitence may break his spirit ever after. Besides, Found another way. Yes, but then you would have known. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. As am I.
That should be too hard. Come, please. Over there. Back to what the That man there. Seize him. A man was killed in the upper balcony. Oh, I, I've got no room. I swear. Any weapons? I beg your pardon. Don't no push him. Please. 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 Don't worry about me, girl. I'll be just doing it. Happened we right must leave that one. What are those men doing in there? And how was the opera? Rather dull, truth be told. Shall we be off then? Aye. To Fleet and Bride. By your command. This book is to be believed. It will open the doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. Ah, yes. Those who ruled, reigned, and vanished from the world. Do we know what it is that will be held within? It could contain certain knowledge. Perhaps a weapon, or something as yet unknown, unfathomable in its construction and purpose. It could be any of these things, or none of them. They are still an enigma, these precursors. But of one thing I am certain, whatever waits behind those doors shall prove a great boon to us all. Or our enemies, should they find it first? They won't. You've seen to that. I assume you know where this storehouse is. Ah, Mr. Harrison. Gentlemen. How fair your calculations? I believe the site lies somewhere within this region. That's a lot of ground to cover. My apologies. Were that I could be more accurate. That's all right. It suffices for a start. And that is why we've called you here, Master Kenway. We'd like for you to travel to America, locate the storehouse, and take possession of its contents. I'm yours to command. Although a job of this magnitude will require more than just myself. Of course. Upon this paper are the names of five men sympathetic to our cause. Each is also uniquely suited to aid you in your endeavor. With them at your side, we'll want for nothing. Well, then I'd best be on my way. I knew our faith in you was not misplaced. We booked you passage to Boston. Your ship leaves at dawn. Go forth, Haytham, and bring honor to us all. Rip everybody. Hundred percent full synchronization. Yeah. I like the outfits. Very cool. Oh. But guys, next time on Assassin's Creed Three.